everyone, this is Advent Rooster, and we're playing Minecraft. Um, we are right where we left off. Um, just fast forwarded a little bit so we could uh, go through the night, which which nothing exciting happened. Uh, we didn't miss much, just a couple minutes of, of a transition there. So, we are waiting for it to be daytime, and I think that's good enough. And there might still be some baddies out there, but about that later. And uh, what I'm going to do real quick, I don't see anybody, I think I think we're clear to do this, is I'm going to make some uh, stone pickaxes. Um, where am I six at? Here we go. And I'm probably going to make five of them. I think that's a perfect amount. There we go. Drag you in there. You in there. You in there. And then a couple for backup. Perfect. Okay. And let's always reclaim the workbench. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this uh, wood pickaxe until it's deteriorated enough. And I think everybody is just as curious as I am um, to go up this waterfall here. So we're going to try to do this here. Wow, the current is really strong. Oh. Oh, me, oh, my, oh. I hope this doesn't uh, do what I think it's going to do. Perfect. I love when physics work my way. Okay. Awesome. Ooh. Let's keep this exploration up. I just want to see what's up. Whoa, neat! Wow. There's pigs having sex and nice uh, flat mountain walls to explore. There's some coal over here. Okay, we are going to tunnel straight um, towards, I guess, maybe in here, yeah. Let's clear out this gravel. And we are good to go. I should probably craft some kind of shovel, but there's really not that much gravel. I got flint. Awesome. Beautiful. I'm gonna dig out this area too. Oh. Okay. Lovely, lovely. Get rid of you. And I might just have to make a shelter out of you. Let's keep this going. Oh yeah. We're going to find out what is in this cool little mountain. Excellent. And I hope this is going over well with you guys. Um, me starting a new... Um, a new land. A new world. And I am just rolling these videos out one by one tonight because I'm bored and I can't sleep. All right. Beautiful. Okay. We're going to go a few more deep this way, and then maybe we'll start tunneling down. I think that'll be awesome. Yeah, let's let's do it. Actually, you know what? Let's... I take that back. We're going to make this a, a nice little... nice little area. A nice little area. There we go. Now we can begin tunneling kind of down. Let me give me one more square to work with so I can avoid tunneling straight down. Getting back up, I will worry about that later. I'm really not concerned for some reason. Uh, let's get some torches here because I know we, it's probably a little bit hard to see. Put one there. Um, let's keep doing it. Never know what we'll find. Okay. <laughs> 
I almost said something really bad, but I caught myself, but it involved a, my my Kratos' is a fist. I just knew somebody would make a fisting joke. Oh my god! Okay. Oh, whoops, I did not mean to do that, but that's okay. <coughs> and... If, I guess I should uh, think of something to talk about while I dig far down. go, that'll work. So, I've been playing Halo Reach today, and I suck at it. And that's all I can pretty much say about that. Uh, I think it's a great game, though, if uh, no one's had the chance to pick it up. Why do I keep going straight underneath me? Stop that. Um, but I'm, I'm having a blast with it. Um, I've, been, I've been a Call of Duty fan. Uh, see, last year I... Uh, I uh, didn't have Xbox Live or, or PSN or any of that good stuff because I, I wasn't able to uh, live in an area that that could uh, support those, those things. So um, now I'm able to, and uh, you know now I see what the hype is about all these uh, multiplayer games, and I get really I like I like to have fun when I play, but I get extremely competitive, and I, I just like to to be kind of, I guess, relaxed, you know, and I think, um, you know, people like Cena Anders put it really good, um, he puts it best whenever he says people get <laughs> maybe too, a little bit too into it, I don't want to offend anybody out there, but it's the truth, I mean, you know, I don't, I don't really, um, I think that's, that's not even right there, but you know what, that's fine, I'll fix it later, but, um, yeah, I, I don't, I think we all get a little worked up or we where we might curse at the game or get excited. But um as far as like degrading one another, um I I think it's uh <laughs> maybe unnecessary, you know. Um it's a, there's just nothing more annoying to me than getting in a in a magic you know, Call of Duty or or uh so far Halo's been pretty pretty uh, modest. But we're we're players are just like, you know, uh demeaning one one another, you know, just like in a total, in a totally malicious way, I just think it's ridiculous. Um, but I haven't really had any of that in Halo, and I assure you, I I have been getting destroyed. <laughs> I have, but um, yeah. Okay, and this is. I wonder if we're gonna find. I call it. I call it bedrock. Um, pretty soon. I don't know, I think we probably still have a lot further to go down. Mm -hmm. hmm. I'm, I'm kind of curious as to what you guys think of my... the music portion of my channel. Um, I don't... I, I love gaming, but this isn't going to be just a strictly gaming channel. Uh, it's going to be entertainment. Um, in whatever way I can provide that, and uh, you know, one of the ways I, I, I love, I've grown up playing the guitar. Um, I'm self-taught. Um, <laughs> I have have many influences. Uh, if you guys ever want to chill and talk about those, I can I can do that. Um, but I uh, I just I like all kinds of different music. Um, I say um a lot. My ear just itched. <laughs> And this is going nowhere. This hole is just going nowhere at all. Let me see. One, two, three, four, right there. Okay, here we go. <coughs> Whoops. There I go again. But, um, yeah, I have several music influences. Um, and so I, I, li I like shredding. Um, I don't, I don't necessarily, I don't know, I, I'm not like a Petrucci with it. You know, to where I can just, I'm I'm able to shred, but you know there there are several several others that are way better than me. I just I like uh, experimenting, I guess. Uh, you can see some of my other songs that I've kind of uh, covered and played on my channel. Um, it's something that I'm, I guess, somewhat self-conscious of, uh, so I really don't like to advertise it. Uh, pretty much, I 
I think this is probably the most modest I'll ever sound. I, I play well, uh, and in some ways I think I even sing well, but uh, <laughs> my, my family, my close friends are the only ones that have ever really gotten to fully experience that. So, yeah. But... <laughs> <laughs> I'd also like to maybe do some uh, talk about movies and TV shows. Um, I'm really into a. Uh, I worked at a Blockbuster for a very, very, very long time. Probably too long. One, two. I can't really tell if that's the right spacing there. But uh, it it turned me into unfortunately a movie snob. So um, you know what? I'm gonna start taking this probably another way. No, I'll just take it. I'll keep going this way. But, uh, you know, now, it, it turned me into a person that's just like, you know, oh, this director's the best, and, and you know, that movie sucks. So, I, uh, my friends were probably really annoyed with it, but I, I really never liked, uh, going to see the, I guess, the, the mainstream movies. Um, but, ever since I quit there, you know, I, I watched, I'll, I'll watch anything, don't get me wrong, I'll watch anything, but I just have a, uh, a strange, a strange taste for movies. Uh, I think Dexter, as far as TV shows, is my all-time favorite thing ever. I've probably seen every single episode um, several times through. Uh, my girlfriend gets really annoyed at me because I'll just, uh, whenever I fall asleep, I have to kind of have something in the background on. So I'll turn on, you know, an episode and and uh, doing that, you know, for the past couple of years, I've just seen everything probably probably about five or six times, um, which is ridiculous, but, you know, I, I don't know if this sounds morbid or not, <laughs> but let's let you in on my sense of humor. I am, uh, I am very morbid. Um, the more morbid I am, I, I think it's, I think it's funny. I, I don't know. Um, people are really, they probably think I'm really, really strange, but, um, I, uh, I mean, I, I don't want to really let loose <laughs> my morbid personality. I'm going to start digging this way, guys. Um, because it'll probably creep some of you out. Well, let's do this. Okay. Yeah, sorry, this, uh, this adventure didn't really do much. I forgot where the whole morbid talk was going to, but... Okay. Get some torches in here. Yeah, I think I was gonna hit the uh, the bottom of the world soon. Is that right? Is that good? Okay, yeah. Notice how I didn't even really build a shelter, but I think I need like resources and stuff like that before I can even really start building a house. We have some gravel here. This is gonna be pretty interesting. Let's dig it up. See, I have one of two theories about dirt and gravel, uh, especially dirt though. Usually, uh, from what I've experienced, it's either randomly placed, which makes sense, and that's look, that looks like what it's going to do, uh, and if it's dirt, usually it's either going to be randomly placed or lead to the surface or some kind of water source, or, you know. It's going to separate what you're doing from, wait, wait, that, that's worded really strange. Um, it's going to separate, like, rocks from water. Um, it's a good divider, but in this case it looks like it was just completely random. So, um, this is probably a great stopping point. Um, I will probably continue this. Uh, it'll it'll go this pace for probably a couple more videos um, to where I'm just digging and tunneling, collecting resources, and then uh, I can really start building. Um, but yeah, this is what I was talking about, how I'm, how I'm going down uh, and I'm taking out four blocks from underneath me and uh, I'm doing the same thing in front of me that way it's just not all these random skinny skinny hallways that that, that is a uh, you know one block width and it just doesn't turn into a maze or a labyrinth of, uh, of confusion so um, if you play Minecraft or if you're just starting out that's a good tip I think and uh, we will talk about getting back up there later I'm not really concerned about that but um, until the next video, thank you for watching. Comment, subscribe, rate, and we'll see you uh, another time.